Hi, my name is David Emerson. I'm a long-term myeloma survivor, myeloma cancer coach and director of People Beating Cancer. Welcome to the vlog post regarding pre-myeloma, MGUS, and autoimmune diseases. According to the two studies um, at the bottom of the blog post, um, two things, good news, bad news, um, an autoimmune disease, if you suffer from an autoimmune disease, uh, your risk of MGUS, monoclonal gammopathy of undetermined significance, is increased. That's the bad news. The good news is that uh, if you have an, um, an immune, uh, autoimmune disease and if you get MGUS, according to research, your risk of developing full-blown or frank multiple myeloma is reduced. That's the good news. Truth be told, while uh, a diagnosis of MGUS or smoldering multiple myeloma is bad, it's the development to the serious stage multiple myeloma, which is the real problem. Uh, if you have uh, an immune, uh, autoimmune disease, your risk is reduced if you have MGUS. That's good. More importantly, there are a number of um, research-based, evidence-based therapies, nutrition, supplementation, um, lifestyle therapies that have shown uh, the ability to reduce the risk of full-blown multiple myeloma. Uh, if you want to learn more about these therapies, scroll down the page, send me an email, send me a question. I will reply to you ASAP. In the meantime, thank you. Uh, hang in there and be well.